family channel but where moms could come and support each other and um, feel like they have somebody in the world that is on the same level or that is going through the same things as them. Um, we are the music makers and we are the dreamers of dreams. Hey you guys, welcome back to another video with Khadija. I am, of course, Khadija. <laughs> Welcome to my channel. If you are new, thank you so much for clicking on this channel. I hope that you will like this video. I hope you decide to like this video and subscribe so that every time I post a new video, you are updated. And if, and if you are a regular here on my channel, you are a real one. Thank you so much. Please make sure you hit that like button and let's get right into this video. So today we are going to be doing some lotion so I am going to be doing a vendor event in about seven days yeah exactly seven days so next Sunday today is Sunday so next Sunday I am going to be doing a vendor event at a church um, and I am going to be selling most of my products and I'm also going to be adding a couple of products that I think I'm just going to add like when I do vendor events um, and I want to I want to bring you guys along this journey with no, not journey But just along this whole process with me of making all of my products, but then also of um, Just how I go about the the vendor event um, So yeah, so this this is probably going to be like a three-part video. So today I'm going to be making my lotions um, I'm thinking of also doing some body oils just because it's kind of easy and fast to do um it is right now about 2 10 i want it to be done at least by five um hopefully i can do that by five baby boy right now is sleep he just fell asleep that's why i was just like you know what let me start this video um so yeah let's get right into this i'm going to just pour off all of my oils all my butters i'm going to melt them and then, um, yeah, we shall just go along this process and come along with me. Decides to start waking up. Great. Yeah, great.
he decided to join us. Hello. Good morning. <laughs> Hi. Hi, baby. So, my oils are melting. My water is still warming up. I right now it's at, I'm having it sit at a temperature of 150 right now for probably about 15 minutes just to make sure that it's nice and sterile. And then as soon as my oil and butter, um, let me turn this around. As soon as my oils and butters um, melt, I will put all of those together. And then, right now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put my preservative. I'm going to use Optif... What is it? Optifin Plus. I'm going to use Optifin Plus. And then I'm going to mix the fragrance in as well. So when everything is done, I could just put those two ingredients together. I'm sorry, I'll put those two ingredients with the rest of the ingredients. And we shall make our lotion. <laughs> Oh, you guys, you guys, summer is almost over. Summer is almost over, and now that everything is getting back to normal, I'm going back to work, so I am trying to really just, just enjoy these last couple of days of summer vacation before I go back to work. Um, so you guys, I have so many vlogs that I have for you guys. I need to keep, I need to look at the camera versus the screen up here. I'm sorry, I'm getting used to it. <laughs> um, but yeah, I have so many videos for you guys. So many videos that I think you guys are going to really enjoy. Um, videos when it comes to me and my hubby. Videos when it comes to just family stuff. Um, the baby, his milestones, Elisha and his milestones. Um, this channel, I really do want to be, a, excuse me, a family channel but where moms could come and support each other and um, feel like they have somebody in the world that is on the same level or that is going through the same things as them um, on this channel I do decide I do want to I do want to hit a couple of like sore spots or sensitive spots like postpartum depression um, Having my second child, I really am still going through postpartum depression. The first, my first baby, I, my mother had said that I did go through it, but I feel like maybe I just wasn't in the right headspace to even know that I was going through postpartum depression. But now that I know what it is um, and have more information and stuff on it, um, I know I truly am going through postpartum depression and I just want to talk about that because I feel like not enough people talk about it but it's something that is real and true and just raw and something that happens to most women who have babies. Um, so yeah, I do want to get into like deep conversations like that. For that one, I think I'm probably thinking of doing like a mukbang or... I don't know something to kind of make it interesting so let me know what you what you think in the comments let me know let me know but now I'm going to uh, uh, pour the preservative and the fragrance together and I shall come back so now I am going to pour the water into the oil and watch how it transforms you guys Ooh, look at how beautiful. It's gonna be a lot of lotion. A lot of lotion. Okay, so now I'm gonna blend it up. Everything is mixed up and it's down to 190 degrees, 19 degrees, 99 degrees, okay. So for this preservative, it needs to, the temperature needs to be under 122 degrees. 
so I just like to make sure that it's under so it doesn't burn or anything so I'm just going to put this in Hey you guys, so I am back. I am sorry I did not show you guys the pouring process. The pouring process oh, is a mess, you guys. It really is a mess. to do this and it's only two four six eight so eight um eight ounce bottles of lotion and then two small um two small four ounce bottles so i mean granted that whole part comes with the process of making lotion and not having all of the i guess necessary materials um one thing I would really, really love to get is, uh, I don't know what it's called, but I'll put a picture up like somewhere right here to show you guys. Um, a lot of people who, who do lip gloss, they use this, um, you know, to make it easier because it does, it's a lot to, um, you know, pour a liquid or somewhat liquid, but also solid in a sense like lotion the lotion like at first it gets super it's like super liquidy it's like water but then as it starts to set you know as everything starts to emulsify it starts to thicken and then once it starts to thicken it's over with like I can't even pour the lotion in anymore so one thing I really do want to get is I want to get one of those little um those things so to help me pour my lotion because I really do like making lotion. Um, there's not a lot of people who make lotion um, and I feel like I have an upper hand in a sense <laughs> with that. Um, so I mean if I could make some, if I could make good money with making my lotion, um, I would definitely invest in um, um, one of those machines. But you guys, I wanted my batteries going to die super soon. So I'm not gonna keep this process long. Um, I am going to keep you guys along with the process. So tomorrow I am going to be making, I wanna say body oils. Um, I did say I was gonna do it today, but today just did not unfold the way I wanted it to when it came, when it came to the whole lotion. Um, so yeah, I am going to and clean up all of these because they are messy. Like, I'm not sure if you guys can see, like, let's see if it's gonna focus. I don't know if you guys can see, like, just all of the, it's messy and it's all bleh. So I'm gonna have to um, clean these a good couple of times um, before I put them to sell um, but you guys let me know what type of things do you guys do for your business like do you guys um, do you guys do vendors do you guys do vendor events do you guys do pop-ups um, what more do you do oops, to take your business that extra mile um, one thing I do do at vendors is I do a lot of extra stuff. So one thing I do not sell on my website, one thing I do not sell on my website that I'm going to be selling um, is, is um, black African face soap. Um, so I am going to make um, some at my for the vendor event. I do want to see how it goes first before I um, sell it online. I want to see how they sell at the vendor event. Um, but yeah. 
So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to finish cleaning these off, I'm going to charge my battery, and then I'm going to come back and I'm going to add the labels to these lotion bottles. And I'll be right back, you guys. Okay, so sorry for the darker view. I am filming it on my camera. I wanted to make sure I got my labels on my products before anything because I didn't want to mix all of the lotions up. So um, like you probably had seen in the other um, video or the last clip, I was just finishing up Bamboo Lavender. So now... I am putting on bamboo. I'm sorry, berry lavender was the last one I finished. If you hear baby boy in the background, yes, he is slowly but patiently waiting for mommy or daddy to come get him. Brother right now is keeping him busy, playing with him. Well, mama could do her business. So here are all the lotions. I most likely will make a diff another batch so I could have more. So I could at least have four of each. I don't know how the lotions are going to go. Um, so if anything, if one of them sells out and more people want them, then I'll probably, you know what? Okay, so I had to grab baby boy. Um, so what I was saying was that if customers want to buy a certain lotion and it's already sold out, then what I'm going to have them do is, um, I'm probably going to do like a pre-sale or just have them buy it and I'll probably give it, give it to them at a discounted price or I'll probably just give them free shipping if they buy it right then and there. Um, but I don't want to have too much lotion or product on hand because my products i like to make them when they are ordered um right now since i have a lot of products that i have to make i am of course doing it ahead of time but it's only a week ahead of time but usually like if somebody orders online then i make the products um when they order them just because i want like my lotions and um like the face masks to be fresh um the body butters and the oils um they are okay to be sitting just for a little bit especially the body butters right now because i do freeze them so um during shipping right now it could just you know hopefully you know it won't melt um or you know i don't know i'm i'm just put i put them in the freezer just to, in the hopes that it won't melt and it would uh stay the consistency that it is now in the next video i am going to be doing body oils and then um we should go from there um so i shall see you guys tomorrow and uh, we'll get to making our body oils